This is guess the word. So um, you're given an array of strings and you're given a method called guess. And if guess returns a six, then you uh, return because you're done. But what you have to do is basically uh, implement a method that will remove words from this word list um, based on guesses that you make. So that way you won't make too many guesses. <clears throat> um, so that's not that clear in the question, but so if you um, add all the words uh, to a set and then you take one of the words and you call guess on it. And then you can compare that number that you get back. So say you get the number um, three because it has three of the same letters that it does for the secret word. So you can compare that number um, to other words in the set. And if there's le if it doesn't equal if it doesn't have the same number of the same letters, then uh, you can remove it. Because basically you're saying like, I know that this word has three letters that are the same as the secret. And so if there's another word in there that doesn't have three letters the same, then you can just remove it. So if not equal, then remove. And that should be it. Um, so we're just going to make a little helper function to count um, characters that are the same between the guest word and others. So um, for a set, it is easiest to use tree set because we can just pull a word from that um, randomly using um, pull first. And then we can use the remove if method on that. So we can just say for every string in the word list, we're gonna just add it to the tree set. And so while the tree set isn't empty, while it's not empty, we're going to keep taking words out of it. So we're going to have a string called word, and we're just going to say, take one word off of it. So that'll take one word out of the tree set. And what will the guess value for this be? It'll be this master guess, guess method, and we're going to pass word into it. And so um, if that guess value is six, that's it. We found the word. We're just going to return. Um, but if not, we're going to remove What are we going to remove? We're going to remove if the um, others, we're going to go through the tree set and remove it if it's not the same as this guess value. So let's write our helper function, which will just be giving us back of the same amount of characters that are in these words. So we'll have um, string S and string T. I'm going to return a value starting off with zero. <clears throat> and we'll say and i equals zero, i less than s length. Because these are going to be the same length. Everything's going to be um, six long. So we'll say if s char at i equals t char at i. The characters are the same in the same spot. We're just going to increase the value. And then at the end, we're just going to return the value.
And so now we're going to call this um, lambda function on all of the values in the tree set. So basically we'll say um, remove if um, we're going to take every word in the set and we're going to say, um, we're going to call this helper function on it. And we'll say for every word in the set, we're calling this on it. And if it is um, not equal to the guess value, we're going to remove it. And that's here, this remove if. And then that's it. It's not for its file. And that's it. Okay.